नमस्कार दोस्तों टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट सेल्फ मेडिकेशन डू यू नो द मेडिसिन डोलो हैज बिकम एन इंटरनेशनल मीम बिकॉज इंडियंस आर कंज्यूमिंग इट लाइक अ स्नैक एटलीस्ट 3.5 पॉइंट फाइव बिलियन ऑफ दिस मेडिसिन हैज बिन सोल्ड सिंस ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी द क्वेश्चन इज वाई आर वी कंज्यूमिंग द टैबलेट लाइक अ मिड डे स्नैक वाई डू इंडियंस डू नॉट प्रेफर गोइंग टू द डॉक्टर why self medication is a thing did you know around the 1960s in the west self care and self medications were regarded as unnecessary and potentially even unhealthy practices how many times have you consumed a combiflam and continued working because a deadline was breathing down your neck despite evidence that long term unsupervised use of it is believed to cause heart disease I see this attitude not only among older folks but also with the younger people. Many use antibiotics of their own accord without a prescription, oblivious to the fact that this recklessness could make the new bacteria in their body eventually resistance to these meds. You know in pop culture parlance it's like white walkers turning the dragon that was meant to kill them into one of them. in a country that is already struggling to provide basic health care to all people experimenting with the different forms of treatment themselves is a crisis in itself so why are we doing it while one obvious reason behind this is the affordability and availability of the doctors india is reported to have about one doctor for every 921 people and 80% of its population has no medical insurance what makes us modern privileged indians who can afford health care so averse to taking appropriate medical help at the right time for one we are likely too busy to care about what happens to our body until our issue is really unavoidable it's the chalta hai attitude taken to a dangerous extreme do you know indian youth is burnt out and time starved from working more hours a week than anywhere else in the world so we just soldier on with our headaches stomach infections and swollen ankles ignoring the pain we feel a foolish sense of pride in boasting to kya hua tumhe headache maine to pura din office mein kaam kiya jabki mujhe viral infection tha this disregard for personal well being perpetuates itself in a vicious cycle where each of us collectively take the other down aside from this idiotic behavior it doesn't help that more of us are turning to the internet for our health problems apne symptoms ko google karke dawai lena is not good google will always tell that symptoms you are having are of cancer aajkal bahut sari aisi websites hain jo aapko aapke symptoms pe judge karke aapko dawai deti hain without even diagnosing you या तो ये या फिर हम अपनी पास वाली किसी भी केमिस्ट के पास जाकर पूछ लेते हैं बुखार की दवाई है क्या एंड रिलाई ऑन द साउंड जजमेंट ऑफ द क्लूलेस बॉय एट द काउंटर बिकॉज इट्स कन्वीनियंट दिस प्रॉब्लम इज स्पेशली कंपाउंडेड विद द वुमेन सोशली कंडीशन टू पुट एवरी वन एल्स इन द फैमिली बिफोर दैम देयर द लेवल ऑफ इग्नोरेंस इज वर्ड्स आई रिमेंबर मेरी फ्रेंड की मदर का ऑपरेशन होना था एंड टू डेज बिफोर दैट शी वॉज कुकिंग फूड फॉर हर होल फैमिली एंड फ्रीजिंग इट सो दैट बिटवीन द टाइम ऑफ हर रिकवरी हर फैमिली मेम्बर्स कैन ईट इट वॉज एज इफ बाय स्पेंडिंग एनी टाइम ऑन हर ओन हेल्थ शी वॉज सम हाउ फेलिंग इन हर ड्यूटीज एज अ मदर वाइफ और डॉटर इन लॉ देर इज अनदर फैड आई हैव नोटिस अमंग पीपल we are going organic and eating natural is a new excuse to avoid doctors i have met people who actually believe that having an apple a day keeps the doctor away people who would rather drink kombucha over cough syrup people who apply a dark chocolate and a avocado mask to treat their skin allergies rather than seeing a dermatologist people who take lavender oil massages to mend the cramps in the shoulder instead of consulting a physiotherapist the more hipster the solution the better to be fair our fear of being conned by unscrupulous and careless doctor is rooted in the news that is filled with medical scams every other day 
stories about fake licenses and rigged medical exams have ensured we have trust deficit but self medication is still no longer viable solution to being healthy fortunately our government isn't ignoring the issue there are soon going to be proper regulations in place governing over the counter drugs that can be sold without a prescription still it's time we stop playing doctor doctor that's it for today's segment thank you